What's up everybody, my name is Coalfire and welcome to Neon Code. Now this is, uh, I, I don't think it's a demo or early access. I'm not entirely sure on that one, but it didn't really mention anything on the, uh, the game page. But it is version 0.8, so I don't think it's a full release either. Not entirely sure what to, to call it at this point, but it's a cyberpunk retrowave noir uh, detective game, I want to say. I don't know. I didn't glean a lot from the Itch.io page, but uh, from what I could tell, this is like a, a passion project of a, of a single developer who's just been working on this in his like spare time after work. And the fact that games can be developed in that way now is uh, mind-blowing to me. And I, I just, I had to check this out. It looked pretty damn interesting. So let's go. This is going to take a little bit to load. That's okay. Ah, here we go. Wow. So I think the whole game is like open world. Neon code. All right. This is cool. Oh, back when I was a cop, I always had a case to work on. Never once was out of money. I thought once I became a tech detective, things would only get better. But this day is just as boring as any other day. I'll soon starve if I don't find a case soon? I didn't see the, the end of that line. I'm sorry. Okay, so is this us? This is definitely us. Yep, we just invaded the back of it. Whoa! Hmm. Those be shots I hear? Perhaps this is my lucky day, and someone will want my services. That's a... Uh, <laughs> pretty cynical way to look at that. But like... Holy hell! We're really just, like, dumped in here. I kind of want to go, like, explore around a little... Dude. Nice outfit. Really nice outfit. That's awesome. Fire hydrant, how you doing? Um... What? Oh, there's a body. Alright. Uh, yes. Blood. Blood, blood is a thing. Oh, okay. He's dead. He has a lot of money on him. No ID. Can't see his face, and I shouldn't defile the crime scene. Uh, I have the first clue. An eclipse entry card. I should tell the police about the body I found. Need to call them right now. It's a simple hat, or as they call it, fedora. Not the greatest fashion sense. <laughs> okay. Uh, he said not to defile the crime scene, and then all of a sudden... Oh, shit. What is this? Okay, so scroll wheel just goes... Uh, scroll up, scroll down is U and J. Um. Oh, these are all of the. Um. All the dialogue. Okay, that's cool. So, what else do we have in here? Nope. Okay. It's just the two. Okay, cool. So. If this is supposed to be cyberpunk dystopian future, we still have payphones. Nice. Nice. Of course it doesn't work. I have the faintest idea why it's out of s- oh. Having the faintest idea why it is out of service. What did that say? Um, I like that I can go into this. Um, I need to go to my office and use the phone there. Alright. Let's, uh, let's go to your office then. So we have a little like waypoint marker at the at the top. So where's our office? Over this way? Is it gonna be like in the shitty shed? Maybe. Private investigator. Floor one, door three. Floor one. Oh good lord. Yep, door three. This is us, right? Maybe? Oh, door four. What's her name? Craig Williams. 
Oh, good lord. <laughs> oh, this is a shithole. I mean, don't get me wrong, it looks fantastic in the game, but this- this is a shithole. Oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. Alright, phone's off the hook. Uh, Reef City Police, how can I help you? I'd like to report a shooting happened a few minutes ago in front of Ocean Drive 2. I sent a patrol right away, could you tell me everything about the incident? Couldn't see the killer. Must have escaped. The victim was a white male, 20s or 30s. Thanks for your cooperation. I'll make sure to send, uh, talk to officers on the scene. Thank you. I'll be right there. Okay, so we head back. Right? Boop. Just like, look at this. This is awesome. I just, I, I just kind of want to hang out in this. Can I can I jump off this? Nice. Okay, that's a that's a quick and easy escape route if I ever need it. Hello, please. That was a good way to do the transition, though, uh, with just the lights going by and bring these guys in. Whoa, you guys are some scary-looking policemen. Jeez, you're tall too. What's up, man? You need me to talk? Are you the witness? Try to, uh, talk to the policeman by the fountain. I understand. Thank you. What are you doing here, Craig? Chief won't be happy when he finds out you're snooping around a crime scene. As much as I, uh, as much as I would like it, you're not a cop anymore. I was the one to find the body. And they say there are no coincidences. What are you doing around here? My office is right around the corner. Went down to the beach to get some fresh air and I heard the shots. Did you see anyone? I didn't. I must have already left by the time I arrived here. Uh, did you find any evidence? Well, I shouldn't say anything considering our past and the fact that you're already checking out the scene. I can tell that he only had money on him. We weren't able to identify him. We couldn't find an ID. His face is cruelly distorted. There's there's been some similar cases recently. It's the work of a professional. No evidence. The body is un unidentifiable. The money wasn't taken. We need to look at the... We need to lock this criminal behind bars. If you find anything, let us know. The chief might take you back. I don't think you guys would want me to get back into the precinct. You always knew how to deal with insane cases like this. This, uh, this one needs to be captured before anything else happens. Alright, I'll call you if I find something. Okay, so I, I already found the ID. Can I tell you about it? Uh, okay. So this... I should head to the Eclipse offices. Hold up. Hold up. Um, I should head to the Eclipse offices. They might know something about this Elliot White. I should use my car to get there. Luckily, I have it in the garage. Okay, so can I not give you the ID? Doesn't look like it. Alright, that's fine. What's up, little droney drones? You guys are kind of cute. Alright. So... We need to go grab our car, then. Yo, You okay there? Okay, yeah, you're good. <laughs> uh... Oh, that is... That's a, that's a good-looking car. Mmm. I love muscle cars. Like, they're not my dream car or anything, but I just, I like, I like muscle cars. Oh, baby! Oh, my wish! My wish has been granted! Oh, yes! Bloody thing doesn't want to start. Hell, I've got to buy a new battery. Oh, god damn it! Alright, uh... What? Anybody over here selling batteries? Anybody? Anybody? No? Man. People around here have an interesting fashion sense. Y'all look the same. Oh, you selling batteries? Engine parts? Batteries. What's up? Uh, welcome to Mr. Robot's Vehicle Parts, sir. How may I help you? I'd like to buy a battery. 20 credits, please. Unfortunately, I don't have that kind of money. Can I just, can I just take one? So, what am I supposed to be doing? 
Do I need to go, like, back upstairs and, like, grab some money out of my... Well, nope, that's increasing. So there's a tiny little bit of a delay in the uh, coffee cup. Oh, 20 credits. Nice. Ah, it's Commander Shepard. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Um, yeah, so I was thinking that the, the dialogue wheel kind of reminded me of Mass Effect. But, like, now Commander Shepard's just, like, straight up on the money. That's awesome. That's so cool. Uh, I'd like to buy a battery. Ooh. Yeah, we got a battery! Nice, let's go. Man, what kind of futuristic muscle car uses a battery like this? Alright. Boop. Let's search for f the fuel, shall we? Fuel. Boop. Boop, boop, boop. This is, this is a fuel can, right? Boop. Ah, uh, boom. Can is empty. I should fill it somewhere. Where where do I get gas around here? Okay. Um Is everything just like There's there's a whole bunch of drums out here. Do you sell gas? Do you sell gas? Who sells gas? Do you sell gas? Engine parts. No. Popo? Beer? That's a different kind of fuel. <gasps> gas! Can I have some gas? Uh, I need some petrol. No problem. Should it be full? See, I don't have any money on me. Can we work something out? Well, you're that private detective from across the building, right? Yep, that's me. Why do you ask? I might work this out if you do something for me. One of those drones patrolling the area recorded some inconvenient things about me. Get the memory card from him, and you can have some free petrol. Uh, do you know where this particular drone is? Should be in the neighborhood, somewhere between the market and the train station. Or perhaps near the beach. Uh, how does one catch a drone? I have the faintest idea. It's all by yourself. Shoot it or something. Oh god! Alright, so this is gonna be like a little quest-a-thon. Where we, we, we have quests and quests and quests. Which, um... You know, if that goes on for too long, I think it can be kind of annoying. But I, uh, drone, 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 drone. Hi, drone. Hi, drone. Drone. Okay, so do I need to go get like a gun or something? He told me to shoot it. Uh, okay. So I have an ID card. I have a coffee cup. I have a gas can. And that's it. All right. So, is there anything else I can grab in here? Gun? Oh! Oh, weird! I don't have an actual body, but I do have an actual shadow. That's kind of- GUN! Alright, let's go break of the law. Drone. Where'd the drone go? Drony drone? Drony drony drone. You were headed in this direction, weren't you? Hello? There you are. Can I just shoot you out in the open like this? Like, how is this- how is this not super illegal? Uh, card is blank. This is not the drone I'm looking for. Fuck! Fuck, dude! I just destroyed government property. Ah, okay. Crap. It's not gonna come back to haunt me, is it? All right. I see another droney drone. Drone. Good lord, man. For fuck's sake, it's not this one either. Third drone should have the card then. Oh, is that like just the like guaranteed? thing, you shoot down two of the drones, no matter what. Eh, eh. This one? Finally. This was a hard day's work. Unfortunately, I'm out of bullets, but at least I'll have the fuel I need as soon as I exchange it with the attendant. I'm really curious what's on that memory card. Oh. What'd that say? 
Uh, I'm really curious what's on that memory card now. Oh, the guy flashed the drone when he was drunk. <laughs> Okay, so that's what, like an indecent exposure charge? Is it... Is it really indecent exposure if you're just exposing yourself to a camera? I don't know. What's up, man? Thanks for solving my situation. Here's my end of the bargain. Later, dude! Thank you! Alright, we got a full gas can. Nice! Nice! We can drive our awesome muscle car now. Let's go. Let's do this. Hey, yeah! Uh, boop. Please, dear, start already. I need to get going. Now I have everything. I need to get to the Eclipse and find more about Elliot White. Oh, God, we're actually driving. Holy shit. Holy crap, man. I wasn't expecting this. I was expecting it just to, like, fade to black. Okay. I can't look around, which is kind of weird. All right. Let's do this. Let's do this thingy thing. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Okay. Wee. <laughs> oh, this is cool. <laughs> All right. So, well, okay. Slow down. Slow down. Um, I, I have a feeling I don't really need to obey traffic laws in this, but I don't know. I just get to drive around now. This is really cool. This, hey, Eclipse. What's up? All right. We're just driving right into the front of the building. All right, let's uh, let's park real quick. Man, everybody's driving like fucking Lamborghinis. All right, uh, can we can we get this nice and? Oh, look at that! Superb parking job. How do I get out of the car, dude? I am a natural. It's almost like I've driven before. Eclipse. What's up, man? Nothing? Okay. I just noticed that the, uh, like, the reticle changes sizes depending on, um, how far away something is. Uh, Eclipse Receptionist. Welcome to the Eclipse Corporation. How can I help you? I need information about Elliot White. I'm investing a investigating a case involving Elliot White, who was an employee here. He was found dead at Ocean Drive. That's terrible. He was such a nice man. What can I do to help? Can you please tell me his address or uh, who he was close to in the company? Uh, Harry Mills. His friend and colleague might know more about him. Mr. Mills is currently on sick leave. They always left work together, and they were friends. He lives on Fontaine Square 8, Floor 3, Door 4. Uh, okay, thank you. That was quite easy. It's time to pay a visit to Mr. Mills at Fontaine Square 8. Alright, so are we are we driving again? Yeah! Let's do this! Vroom vroom, baby! Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Where to? Lead me to the promised land, oh glorious car of mine. Okay, is this is this it? Are we, are we just leaving the car here? Fontaine Square 7 8 Man, this whole place is a shithole. Floor 2. What is it? Floor 3, door 4? Let me see. Uh, third floor, fourth door. So 1, 2, 3 this one hello seems like I'm late I hope there's still something left that I can work with okay that's kind of cool ooh enter the pin code 834 no Okay, so we need to find a pin code. Right away, this makes me think, like, this is a clue. Like, one, two, three, or something like that. Let me, let me see. Okay. Worth a try. 
Ethan's Bar at 8 o'clock? Okay, had a meeting at Ethan's Bar. I should go there. Let's do it then. Let's get our bums out of here. Oh, we can jump. Jersey Toys. Where is Ethan's Bar? Like, is this, is this gonna tell me anything? Oh, we have a waypoint now. Okay. I will follow that. Ah! No, beautiful car. I did not mean to wreck you. I am so sorry. Okay, so is this just like guiding me to the general area that I need to be in? Like... The... Oh, Ethan's Bar. Nice! I feel like I just kind of got lucky with that. Um, where's the door? What's up, guys? Oh, hey there. Sorry. My bad. Uh, <laughs> I like how the music changed in here. Come me this bar. What can I get you? Information about Harry Mills. Do you have anything about a certain Harry Mills? Mills is a regular here. I think he works at Eclipse. You know where I can find him? I haven't seen him in days. He used to come in here with a guy every day. By the way, you're not the first one to ask about him. A woman was asking about him a few days ago. I told... I told her what I just told you. I used to be a regular here, coming in after work around 8 to 9 p.m. Uh, the woman is in here every night since then. You might want to wait for her. She should be here soon. Okay. Yeah, drink to pass the time. Is that how I'm supposed to wait? <laughs> oh, this is cool. This is really cool. Lady has arrived. She usually sits down at the booth in the back. Thanks, man. Really appreciate it. Booth in the back. Is this her? Alice. Who are you? You can at least tell me your name now that you're here anyway. Private investigator. Craig Williams. Private investigator at your service. What can I do for you, detective? Did you want to buy me a drink or... I'm investigating Elliot White's murder case. The clues led me to this bar, where allegedly you've been asking around for Harry Mills. What can you say about that? The walls have eyes here. We could use your help, but we need to talk somewhere else. Follow me. Lead the way! Alright, let's go! This is kinda cool! Like... I don't know, the, the pacing seems a little bit off, but like for a solo developer making all of this, this is like, this is some super impressive shit. All right, where are we going? What are we doing? The walls have eyes here. That's a good way to put that. Hi. As you can see, I'm parked right over there. What's up, <laughs> Gun Panda? How are you? <laughs> no graffiti. Yeah, just like the amount of detail in this world is really... Am Get out of here? Okay. Guys, the walls are talking to me. Telling me to do things. Uh. We're going to the church, are we? Maybe? I love that the cross is just neon. Man. Can we, can we talk now? Is that, is that cool? No? Alright. Let's keep walking then. Oh. We're going to see a movie. Alright. I don't have any money on me. Are you pay it? I don't know, man. I'm sorry. I'm real sorry. Okay. The Violet Crown. Okay. Finally, we can talk here. My name is Alice White. Elliot was my brother. Uh... Did you talk to him before his death? He called me three days ago. He seemed very distracted. Didn't say much. Only that... Uh, only that it's about one of his friends, Harry. They found something, something big that could lead to trouble. And he ended the call because he had to run to a, uh, yeah, because he had to run to a meeting. Uh, 
Why'd you go to the bar every night? It was Elliot and Harry's favorite pub. They always went there uh, to vent a bit after work, the same hour each night. I guess you haven't seen Harry since the, then either. No, he didn't come to the bar. At least, I didn't see him. Anything else that might help moving forward? I think someone was following me yesterday, but it might have just been my imagination. Let's be careful. I'll look into this. Uh, anything else that might help? They owned a storage place at a place called Base. They spent a lot of time there. It's a warehouse at the dock, storage number 10 if I'm not mistaken. Uh, okay, cool. Now we know to go there. I need to go check out the storage room by the warehouse. Maybe I'll find a lead there. I have, uh, I have no idea how long this game is. I don't know if it's like 30 minutes or if it's two and a half hours. So I, I might just start doing some cuts. But the game does have a save feature. Like I could, I can load stuff up if I need to. Uh, whoa, sorry, I didn't look both ways before crossing the street. So, I guess I could do a second episode on this. I kind of want to. So I have no idea how long this is going to be. Ha 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 Okay, let's, let's just keep, keep going. Uh, do, 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 do. Going real fast, driving around. And all of a sudden, my waypoint disappears. Alright, we're coming in here. Thanks, car. You're the best car. <laughs> What's up, man? Uh, I'd like to enter. I need to access my storage. Can you open the gate? IDs, please. You know, safety first. Honestly, the storage isn't mine. I'm investigating a murder case, and there might be evidence in there. Please open up. I'll be done in no time. Sorry, sir. I can't let you in without a warrant. Uh, no, we need the ID. Uh, I'd like to enter. I'd like to access my storage. Can you please open the gate? IDs, please. You know, safety first. Oh, boo! I was kind of hoping that I could just use the, the ID to get in. Get out of here. Um, can I, like... Okay. Okay, am I actually supposed to break in? I feel like I might need to. Alright. Yeah, now I feel like a private investigator. Okay, am I am I going back here or something? Is is this where I'm supposed to be? Hello. Alright. Uh, where All right, yes, we are behind where, where we needed to be. So there's 16. There's 3. 6. 12. Okay, so we need to get over to the other side then. Is there a staircase over here? Yeah, right here. Beautiful. <laughs> Man, I gotta say, like, the, the level design in this is pretty... Pretty damn good. Sneezing coming in. <laughs> oh, oh god! Oh, I'm sorry. At least I warned you. Alright, is that is that enough? Uh scene storage base? Enter pin code. I don't have a pin code. Shit. How do I Hmm, do I have anything that might actually Indicate the pin code? You'll find a lead there. 834, maybe? Oh, no. Uh, no, 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 no. There we go. Uh, 834. Uh, no, 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 no. 438? Hmm. Yeah, where am I supposed to find these pins? Are, are some of these other ones unlocked? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. No, I've got myself stuck. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, well, I am gonna leave this episode here. 
because I've been playing for about 40 minutes. Uh, can I save? Load last checkpoint? Let's see what the last checkpoint was. Okay, so that's that's not terrible. Um, finding Elliot's body, car is ready, I can now go to clip. According to Alice, the, the place called base is important. I have to find storage tent in the warehouse. Okay, cool. Yeah, so... Um, this is really, really cool. Like, seriously cool. I came into this expecting, like, uh, maybe a five-minute kind of goofy, kind of janky uh, investigation about a murder that, you know, just would take me over a very small part of town. But, like, the map is huge huge and detailed and I actually feel like I'm investigating in a world that just has a lot of character and it feels really lived in and it's just it's gross it feels like a city and that's so cool I don't know like of course the the animations aren't fantastic the, the cars patrolling around have some issues turning, and the English in the dialogue is not perfect, because I think uh, the developer has, like, English as a second language. That is all completely forgivable for, like, the scale of all of this. And, uh, I don't know, it's just, this whole thing has been super, super impressive. Uh, despite some of the, the small issues that the game does have, I could easily overlook all of those. And I think with a little bit of polish and maybe some some voice acting, this, this game could be, like, really fantastic, even better than it already is. And I, uh, I'm probably going to do a second episode on this, because it does have a save function, as far as I'm aware. And, um... Maybe get a little bit of help concerning the, like, how to find the pin codes. Because I honestly do not think I have seen or at least recognized a single one yet. And uh, there have been a couple things that have been protected by pin codes. And, you know, it's like, this is almost like Deus Ex, really, without the, the combats, which is completely fine. That's what this really reminds me of. This really reminds me of, like, uh, Human Revolution and Mankind Divided. Wow. Wow. And, like, there, I think there's a bunch of little su subtle nods to, uh, and some not-so-subtle nods to Mass Effect in here, because Eclipse is in Mass Effect, and Commander Shepard was on the money. <laughs> oh, man. But this has been Neon Code. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Coldfire, and I see you next time.